Hello again. So, you know, you've seen the title of the um, of the video, so you know what we are doing here. So, I got this package in the mail from Avelina de Moray, and which is, of course, the Ray Ray Phillips bag. And I wanted to wait and open this on camera just so everybody could see. And I am ridiculously excited. I wanted this bag from the moment I saw it, and, well, Avelina was having a sale on this bag, so I had to take advantage of it, so let's just dive right into it and see what we got. Uh. Ooh, let's see. What's this? This is like the, probably stuff that's got my information on it that I don't need to share with you. Yep. Alrighty. And now the bag itself. Oh. Oh, this is so. Oh, look at this. Look at this. It comes in this lovely little bag, which is, which I think is way, way nice. So if I actually want to make sure that it doesn't get damaged when it's not in use, I can put it back in this bag. Oh. Oh, I can already see the edge of it. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh, oh, wow, Ooh. look at this, isn't this gorgeous, and then it's got this, oh, it's got the zipper on the back, let's open that up, and let's see if my phone will fit in here, I don't know, it seems like it might be kind of a tight fit, yeah, I think that's going to be, well, maybe, looks like it's, yeah, it might fit, yeah. Hmm. Nope, it looks like maybe that's going to be too... Well, maybe. Yeah, it'll fit. It's a bit tight, but my phone will fit in here in the back. So, and so I might go ahead and do that and just keep it in there so the material stretches out a little bit. Alrighty. Now, let's go take a look on the inside of the bag. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, yeah, it's got the little... Mm, it's got this little mirror here, so let's just peel the plastic off of that. Oh, yes. Mmm. Oh, hell yes. <laughs> that is great. And now we have inside the bag, we've got stuffing and more stuffing. Ooh, ooh, the shoulder strap is in here. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow, and this is like nice, nice heavy-duty chain. I like that. It's got some heft to it. Oh, wow, that is excellent. Oh, well, i got to attach the, the chain here. Let me see, where does the chain attach? Right on these things here on the side. And this little part here swivels, which is great, so I'm just going to go like, like that. And then on the other side, do the same thing. Oh, 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 oh. oh man, this is fantastic. Uh, and I haven't even gotten to the rest of the bag yet, and I'm already in love with it. Uh, oh, come on, you. Okay, right off the bat, I do have a minor complaint. This little snap hook is kind of stiff, and it, you know, but but you know what? It sh hopefully won't be a problem. But it does like when it snaps back, it doesn't want to go all the way, so I have to like push it. But I think it'll be okay. So I'm, it's not a huge deal. Oh, let's see here. Oh. Yes, and I love wearing my bags cross body like this. Look, I'm just gonna stand up and see like where this sits on me, because I am a. Yeah, that's not bad actually. That's that's really not too bad. No, that's that's great. 
All right, let's get into the rest of the bag, shall we? So, yeah, we got more stuffing. Yeah, got this little tag that says Avelina de More, so I'll take that off eventually. More stuffing. A little desiccant packet. And then... Oh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if you'll be able to see that, but inside here, it's got this little... Oh, let me see if I can... Get up close so you can see that. It's got the little, I don't know if it'll focus, come on. But it's got the little, the little metal thingy in here that says, that says Ray Ray Phillips by Avelina de More. That's really nice. And then we've got these two, you know, pockets here. And then it's got this little zipper pocket. And something that's not mentioned in other videos is this little zipper pocket actually doesn't go all the way to the bottom. So you can actually run past your hand under under this pocket. So it's actually just like a like a little pouch basically that's just attached on the sides and not on the bottom. So that's that's kind of interesting that it does that. I don't know if that's it, what the use behind that is, but and then a little nice. That's oh that's really cool. Now one sec, I'm going to go grab my wallet and see if my wallet will fit in here. Okay, I've got my wallet, so I'm going to see how well my wallet fits in here. Oh yeah. Yeah, my wallet fits in fine. She calls this bag a clutch, but honestly... In my opinion, this is this is bigger than a clutch. This is a purse, and it's actually a decent sized purse, which I really love. Because I, I like to carry a lot of crap, so being able to carry all this crap is really nice. Oh, and I, I love I love this this sort of bat wing design on the front because it's very gothy, but it's like not super immediately obvious that it's meant to be bat a bat wing and uh, I just love the fact that this bag is just very gothy but also very classy the bag I, I my everyday bag is a, a Killstar bag with an inverted pentagram on it and I love that bag but for certain occasions you know dripping be, you know dripping with pentagrams is not the best thing so I like the fact that now I've got a really gothy bag for Occasions where I need to be a little more appropriate and toned down. Oh, this is just so beautiful. And this little purple filigree. Uh, let me see if I can give you a close-up of that. Oh, this bag is just so ridiculously pretty. Yeah, and I definitely should be able to fit some basics in here. And, and you know, it actually... I mean, the bag actually stretches out a decent amount, so I should be able to fit... Oh, on the inside of the bag, it's made out of this, like, velvet material. Oh, it's so gorgeous. This is such a nice bag. Oh. And then, for the closure, it's a little magnetic clasp, so... Easy enough. Oh. I absolutely love this bag. Thank you very much, Avelina, for sending me this, and... Thank you, Ray Ray, for being the inspiration for this bag because I love purple and I I absolutely love this bag. It's so ah, uh, I just ah, uh, I can't ah, uh, man, I can't get over it. Oh, and uh, yeah, and another word on the material that I forgot to mention: the uh, the bag is entirely vegan, which is great. So this is like some kind of faux leather. But it's really smooth and just feels really nice. Like, this is definitely feels like a really nice quality bag. Oh, and then all the oh the velvet type material on, on the inside. Oh, it feels so nice. Yeah. Yeah, this is oh. Oh, and the zipper on the on the inside pouch is it's really super smooth. So definitely, you can tell that, a, that quality went into this bag, you know?
And the zipper on the back is also... The zipper on the back is not quite as smooth as the one on the inside, but it's still pretty darn smooth. So I don't... I don't anticipate too many problems with this. Uh, oh, and something else. The detail on the zipper, it's got this little like this little sort of pattern on the zipper. Let me see. I don't know if I'll be able to zoom if you'll be able to see this, but I'll try to zoom in. I don't know if my camera's gonna wanna focus. Come on, camera, focus. Oh come on, you're set to autofocus. What's the problem? Uh, yeah, I don't know why it's not wanting to focus, but there you go. But it's got this nice little, it's just this nice little pattern detail on the zipper. <clears throat> then you've got all the little jewels on here, and and the strap is all just covered in the same little jewels. Like, this is such a gorgeous bag. Oh. See, now I'm kind of torn, because a part of me wants to, you know, put this bag away and just have it for special occasions. And there's the part of me that's like, oh, no, no, this is a, I want to use this bag. Like, there's a part of me that just wants to make this my everyday bag. So, I mean, right now, <clears throat> honestly, like, I'm, I'm, I'm actually half tempted to just get another one of these. So I can have one for special occasions and one for every day, because this is such a gorgeous bag. Oh, oh man. Now, now that I've seen what the quality of Avelina's bags are, I might just have to order some more of them, especially when they come on sale. Thank you again, Avelina, for having this on sale, because I'm poor, and this having that sale definitely helped. Oh, this is such a ridiculously gorgeous bag. I am in love with it. Oh, I just, I can't get over just how ridiculously nice this bag is. Oh, it is so, so, so nice. Oh, oh that is so nice. Oh. That is such a nice bag. You know, and I love the fact that this isn't a bag you can just get anywhere, so... You know, so if I go out, if I go out with this bag and somebody goes, Wow, that's a really great bag! You know, like... Where'd you get it? And, you know, it's like... I'll be... I'll be having a very unique bag that, that other people aren't gonna have, and it's... It's a unique style, which is just great. Oh... And it just, it fits perfectly with my, with my style, you know, which is, I love purple, and I love goth, and this just is a really nice mesh of the two, and it's just so nice and so elegant, like, ah, I cannot get over just how, ah, how amazing this bag is. Yep, definitely money very well spent. Again, Avelina, you are just, you rock. Keep making bags, because people will keep buying them. I'm certainly going to keep buying You know, I'm certainly planning on looking for keeping an eye. I'm probably going to get more bags, maybe some of the uh, wallets as well. Oh, and this chain. This chain is just really great. It's got heft to it. It's definitely a really nice chain. It's not just some junk chain. Oh. Come here, you. Oh, this is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I just can't get over how nice this is. Oh. Oh. Mm. oh, this bag is just so, so pretty. Oh. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to be done rambling on about how much I love this bag. But, yeah, I will put a link in the video description to Avelina's website where this bag is to be found if you want to pick it up. 
and unfortunately the sale that she had is over it was like a it's like a 72 hour sale something like that so oh and another thing i forgot to mention um the bag the bag actually came came reasonably quick considering it came all the way from australia so so i'm definitely pleased with that it didn't take super duper long but yeah i love this bag so much Thank you again, Evelina, and thank you, Ray Ray, for being the inspiration for this bag. Ah, oh, I love it. So that is it for the for me, and I will see you all later.